Hi. Today I want to talk to you about uh, checking your def fluid before you put it in your vehicle. Um, this one I bought from AutoZone. Um, the little tube that, that goes onto the end that you want to stick into uh, the opening there uh, to check it and to draw the fluid out, it breaks every time. This thing's about 20 bucks. Uh, I decided, uh, I've already changed it a couple times. I decided I'm not going to do that anymore um, because you can just put that all the way down in there and uh, draw it out. You don't really need that tube. Uh, now, depth is kind of messy. Um, so, uh, you want to have some water on hand to draw it back out and clean it, you know, to clean this out. Uh, but anyway, if you have a diesel vehicle, this is what you need to, to do now. Um, I keep this in my truck. Um, that way I always have it and I basically put it into a, uh, a Ziploc bag so I don't have to deal with uh, any of that stuff getting on anything. Um, so anyway, uh, I bought this particular brand of diesel fluid. Uh, it's really cheap. It's two and a half gallons uh, for $7.88 at Walmart. Um, and usually that's about all that I add at a time. You know, um, diesel fluid is uh, susceptible to the heat, so um, it, it'll go bad on you if you leave it out in the heat for too long. It's something like six months. Uh, now, uh, some people that don't use their vehicle that often or just for towing, uh, that they could run into that, that issue. So that's why I only put two and a half gallons in there. I tow with it, with my vehicle, but uh, only at certain uh, times do I want to keep it full, uh, the death fluid full. So anyway, uh, this one has a date on it. You want to check the date on them. Uh, I'll zoom in on that. You can basically see that that's the date that you want to buy. This one's only a month old, so that's really good. Uh, the ones that are a gallon, uh, they're always old. Every time I've gone to any Walmart, uh, they're always old, so I do not buy those. Uh, so anyway, um, it comes with a little tube. You screw that on there, uh, onto the lid there, and then you can fill your car up. I've never had one leak yet, so that's good. Uh, anytime you, you open this up, uh, there is a, a little seal on this, uh, so basically you have to pull that off. now. A lot of times, if you have actually check them at Walmart, uh, these will be actually tore off or they'll just be laying on there. They, um, you won't even have to pull it off. So you get what you get sometimes uh, because people are checking them to see that you know theirs isn't peeled off. So, But anyway, as long as you check your fluid uh, with one of these depth checkers, um, again, this is 20 bucks, bought it at AutoZone. You can buy it at Amazon for, I think, $19. Uh, this piece is going to break off. It's done it every time for me. So anyway, let's go ahead and tear this off. It's just foam. So we'll pull this off. And it does, it's a little messy. So we're going to draw this up to the line. There's a line there. Alright, so I ended up trying to insert the tip but there's a thing on there to hold the hose that uh, you can't use anymore so i can't get it all the way down in there so anyway i uh put the liquid now into a clear glass you can see what it looks like right now it's definitely uh it's you know just looks like water so anyway let's draw it up and now i'm about up to where it needs to be so hopefully you can see that there are two floating that's the line right there and that means that it's good and it actually is a 32 uh 32.5 which is what it you want it to be and that's it if you have three of these then you do not want uh, to use that so anyway that's how you do it Check your def fluid. You don't want to have error codes on your uh, your vehicle uh, because you didn't check it and then you put in some bad uh, def. Now, if you do, it, it could cost hundreds of dollars, depending on if it's, uh, you know, your tank is uh, hard to drain or not. So on mine, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't be good. I have a Nissan Titan XD, so uh, it's pretty costly if you have to have that drain. So anyway, use one of these. 
uh, and you know, check your death fluid before you, you put it in. So that's it. Hope you like the video. Thanks.